All right, welcome back to the Knives Fast channel, guys. Say hello to Ren and Stimpy and Patter Test Man, Log TV and Choo Choo, and let's get started with today's video. Okay, got a couple of packages to open for you, and you can actually see, uh, if you look real closely, I already uh, cut this one open upstairs. Uh, we thought this was uh, something else because it's at Amazon, but this is actually a knife. Uh, so... This company um, asked me, I, I reviewed one of their knives. It's an Amazon company, Lothar. Uh, I reviewed one of their knives and they uh, asked if I wanted to review another. And I'm like, yeah, but it's uh, been about, oh, I don't know, a month <laughs> since we had that conversation. So I forgot it was coming. This is the Lothar EDC pocket knife for men. Uh, 3.2 inch D2 uh, black blade, uh, folding pocket knife, carbon fiber, uh, handle pocket knife for daily liner lock. Wow. All right. Well, um, I think if this is what we talked about, I think this is going to be the petrol. Uh, there's a lot on that label. Um, so I'm not sure. But the one we talked about... Oh, I cannot get this box open. This is terrible. Hold on just a second, guys. Let's see. Um, the, uh, the little tab is absolutely stuck. Really, I don't want to rip it because I will most likely end up giving this away and I don't want somebody to have a ripped up box. All right, here we go. I got it. All right, that was a pain. And it comes in, of course, the really cool Lothar uh, zip-up pouch here. I really like the look of that. It's kind of the fake carbon fiber look uh, with their really cool logo. I think their logo is cool. Now, again, I said in my first video, I think it's a German company that uses a Chinese factory, but I am not sure for sure. Uh, it does come with a cloth. Really nice. Yep, this is the petrol, I believe. So this is the one that Lefty EDC was raving about. Now I've seen a big red, whoa, big red with one as well. Um, and so I'm glad to get to check this out. Very, very nice. So uh, you have this kind of, I don't know if it's peel ply or it's uh, carbon fiber over G10, it may well be. But if I remember, these are like $35. Wait, I got to adjust my light. It looks a little dark. There we go. Um, got a new light, by the way. So uh, anyway, got a red pivot collar. Uh, there is oil all over this thing. So give me just a second to wipe that off. And then we will look at it. And we also have a second package that I'm very excited about as well. Very thin. All right, let's try this one. Everybody said they're very snappy. Okay, yeah, you hear that detent, guys? Listen. It's got like a click to it. Let's see if we get that when we go in. Yeah, not... Yeah, oh, yeah. Did you hear that? Wow. It's a really stout, uh, but not too stout detent. Flicks out of there like mad. Uh, does drop, well, I wouldn't call it super droppy. I mean, it comes down to your thumb and then it's a shaker, uh, but really thin four finger knife here. Very, oh, I like this and I like this very aggressive blade shape. Now, can I, can I flick it? Really? Okay. You can, but it's really stout. You got to get out to the end of that fuller. And now I will say too, it's very thin guys, this blade uh, is extremely thin. Look at that. Uh, very, very thin. I'll be excited uh, to cut with this one and do a review for you guys. So that is the Lothar Petrol. All right, let's see what our second one is. Um, I kind of know, but uh, you guys don't. Now, I've been talking to, um, well, this one doesn't really need to be cut open, unfortunately. This is uh, this has uh, basically not been taped, uh, which is interesting. So what we got to do is pop this open to the person that sent this to me <laughs> you might want to tape those in the future just to to ensure the safety of your package now guys you guys know uh we have a member of the community uh that is on my streams all the time that talks about um Okay, I'll read this in just a minute. Um, I, that talks about making his own small fix plays. That's Aries EDC. And I reached out to him uh, after uh, our buddy David Tooley said, hey, he might want to send one to your channel and, and uh, you know, see if, see if you want to review it. And I'm like, heck yeah. So he's making these, um, and I forget, I can't remember, I think he's selling them 
Are they on Instagram or does he have like an Etsy site? I think he's got an Etsy site. And so I'll leave the link to the Etsy site. But, I mean, he's got Kydex. It is moving around a little bit in the Kydex there. This is not a review, just an unboxing. But look at this blue. Uh, these are little small EDC fixed blades. He's using AEBL um, and uh, sometimes 1095 on these little EDC fixed blades. I saw this one, was interested. He agreed to send it. Now, I'm going to send it back to him when I'm done so he can actually sell it. So I want to read what he says here. Thanks for offering to look at one of my knives and possibly featuring on your channel. It's an honor. As a part-time hobbyist maker, I'm still learning my craft, and I try to push myself to become better at what I do. Um, I decided to give it a try. I'm skipping a little bit here. Uh, my designs are meant to be EDC size fixed blades that are easy to carry on the belt. And you guys do, you have a soft loop here with buttons. So that is cool. Um, or a bag of some kind. I t take inspiration from the production world of pocket knives in my design. And I think of them as fixed blade equivalent to a folder. Uh, with only basic power tools such as a 1x30 grinder portable band saw with a stand and a cheap Harbor Freight drill press, I'm able to create what I love and I hope you enjoy it as much. Uh, I hope you enjoy the blade and see what the vision is. Okay, and this is from Aries EDC. So let's open this up. Okay, like I said, you know, uh, work in progress on the sheath there. I think he even said that. Guys, we have a hand rub satin blade. That's what excited me. And then he's got like a little indent, like a poon here for your thumb. No jimping, don't need it. Um, it is only a three finger fixed blade for me, but you have a lanyard here to kind of, uh, and very nice on the lanyard tie there, Aries. Very, very cool. Uh, you have, uh, that is awesome. His, um, his uh, pins go all the way through. That is pretty cool. Um, you do have, wow, okay. A little thicker stock, but he's coming down to a nice flat grind edge here. He actually has a full-on sharpening tool. Heck, man, some of the production companies can't even get that right. But we got plenty of relief there. Dang, okay, I am excited to carry this um, and check it out for sure. I'll be careful with it because I want him uh, to be able to sell this. But that hand rub finish, and he's got his Aries EDC logo right there. You guys see that? Come on, focus camera. Very nice. Um, very nice looking edge on this guy, too. Uh, very cool. Now, he is selling them. He's got several listed. When I looked uh, a couple days ago, he had a, several listed. Now, you do actually have kind of contouring to the scales here, rounding, and it feels pretty good. Um Nice and thick fills up your hand. Yeah, you can get down like this. Tell you what, let's, again, I always say I don't do cutting on an unboxing, but what the heck, we're going to just see. Aries, I'm going to put you on the spot right here. You ready? Oh, my gosh. Okay, yeah, I thought so based on what I was seeing. And then piercing-wise, yep, right on through. Uh, pierces really well with that tip. Uh, so, yeah, we'll do more cutting in the... Um, Matter of fact, we'll do we'll do a little bit of cutting in the uh, in the review. I, again, I don't want to to dull it. Uh, I want him to be able to sell it, but I'm sure he can touch it up before he sells it. But very cool. I just wanted you guys to know. I've so here's the thing. I I, I saw him post in my comments before one of my little fixed blades. Well, I thought he was just making them for himself. I didn't realize he was actually selling them. And making a bunch. So, um, guys, I, I when I heard that, I was like, yeah, please send one so I can get the word out. So, um, shoot, this is really nice. And, and I, like I said, I'm excited to try to carry it. It'll stay. The retention's pretty good. I mean, it's not like really super stout, but it's not coming out. Yeah, not coming out. Very nice. And, uh, again, a beautiful blade shape with that worn cliff there. Almost sheep's foot, but... Uh, I, I would call it a Warren Cliff. And again, it's a little small for me, but again, with the um, with the lanyard, that's pretty good. So our two knives, you know what? I forgot my wooden tray. Where is it even? <laughs> Where, Where's my tray? Oh, this is bad. Okay. Um, there's, a, there's a reason. Oh, I know where it is. I know where it is. Uh, so 
Um, very cool. I was like, why does this lighting look different? Well, that's why. There's no tray. So you've got the petrol from Lothar. Lothar, thank you so much. I appreciate you guys uh, sending this one along. Uh, I just asked, and they're like, absolutely, we'll send it. So once they had one available, I think what it was was they didn't have any. Um, you guys bought them all after Kevin's review and um, and JB's, and uh, they didn't have any to send me right then and there. So very cool. I love how thin it is. And, again, guys, this is like a $30 knife, I think, 35 maybe. Um, I can't remember. We'll, we'll do full details on the price and everything else in the review. So Aries EDC fixed blade, I'll have the link down below. Lothar Petrol, I'll have the link down below. And uh, thanks guys for checking this out. Definitely give me a thumbs up. Comment on what you think of these down below. Like, comment, subscribe, notification bell. And thank you so much uh, for everything you guys do, for your kindness, your friendship, and for watching the Knives Fast channel.